What's going on everyone? It's Adam here from Adam's Nintendo World and GamesReviews.com with another episode. Inching closer to episode 100 of Pioneers of Olive Town. No. I almost said Pioneers of Olive Town, Story of Seasons. No, 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 no. Story of Seasons, Pioneers of Olive Town. <laughs> Thank you for stopping by. I really do appreciate it. On today's episode, we will be heading back into town to see what we can do about finishing up some more of those mysteries. We need to upgrade our watering can because we're going to be doing a lot of watering of our green peppers over in the autumn farm that we unlocked, which I forget the name of. It's gusty today, which uh, I don't know if that impacts anything that important, but uh, it's gusty today. <laughs> Maybe there's like animals you can only get when it's like this. I'm sure there are, and I'm sure I'm going to miss them, but that's fine. Thank you again for stopping by. Quick shout out to all my Patreon supporters. You'll see them throughout the farm. You saw two of them inside the house. Kyrie and Alexis inside the house. And you're going to find a bunch more in our barns and in our coops. And I just want to give a shout out to all those folks who have donated so generously to the channel. They allow us to do giveaways, upgrade some of my equipment, and uh, put some money away for when something does break magically. Not magically. I say that so oddly. But there are a bunch of equipment needs that I definitely need to look forward to. Uh, a computer is probably down the road just because of how much that's going to cost. Which is fine. But we want to get a good vlogging camera. So we can start doing some home vlogs. Because uh, a lot of you have asked, hey, what do you do in a general day? Or how do you record videos? I would love to be able to set up a camera and say, hey, this is what it looks like while I'm recording a video. Uh, we also are going to be working on a brand new channel, and I'm not ready to divulge too much information about that. Uh, it is a work in progress. We haven't uh, finalized anything or officially decided uh, what the name's going to be and all that jazz, but it's going to house content that doesn't fit on Adam's Nintendo World. Mostly around physical products. So you're going to see probably toys. You're going to see some video video games. Yeah, you might see some video games like PlayStation and Xbox. You're going to see some vlogs, uh, some of our Disney stuff, some of our Disney trips, um, and some of the other cool things we do like uh, press events once we can do those again and stuff like that. Stuff that doesn't fit Adam's Nintendo world. Um, we have great partnerships. I have great partnerships with a bunch of companies like Ravensburger, like Lego. Uh, the Pokemon Company. Just some great companies that provide me some products from time to time that I really would just like to show and share off with you guys. And it'll also allow me to work a lot more with my kids, which I'm looking forward to. So be on the lookout for that. We're probably, from the time of this recording, I would say we're probably a month out. Like, it's going to be a little bit. It's not like we're ready to launch this thing tomorrow. So... But that is something to look forward to. Uh, I am using some funds to get that channel off the ground as well. Um, if you are a Patreon supporter of this channel, you auto become a Patreon supporter of the other channel and continue to get your shout outs in most videos. In some videos like this one, I will more reference your donations and tell people that they can see you wandering my farm. But in general, you do get those very specific shoutouts, so be on the lookout for a brand new channel coming from Adam's Nintendo World. And I'm sure it'll be Adam something world. Like, I'm sure that's how we're going to um, kind of brand it. So it falls right in line with Adam's Nintendo World. Anyway, that was a lot of talking. Let's get into what we're doing. We're taking care of animals right now. We're going to have to hop over to our autumn farm, obviously, and deal with our green peppers over there. We did harvest the last of our broccoli, so we're going to want to pick up some more of that and get that planted. And so much more. It's going to be a... Uh, oh, better not forget uh, Holly over here. It's going to be a very busy episode, so thank you for joining me. I hope you've been enjoying the content. There is a giveaway going on right now for a copy of this game, thanks to XC Games. We are going to announce that winner on episode 100. You can find details on my Twitter, which I think should be linked down below, but you can also find information on episode 83 of Story of Seasons. So if you head over, click on episode 83, you'll get more details about that giveaway. Okay. Let's 
quickly deal with all of our amazing animals here. I wonder if we're full stars with everybody here. That's a good question. Let's check the ledger. Let's check that ledger in just a moment. It's pretty early in the morning still, only 10.30. We do have a bunch of stuff we need to do in town, uh, mostly upgrading our watering can. We're gonna have to come back and head over to that autumn field I was talking about, because we have a lot more work to do there as well. Okay, these animals make a lot of noise. Yeah, we're like almost 10 and 10 on everything. Beautiful. All right, let's get out of here. All right, gusty, gusty wind. I don't enjoy the winter months, I've decided. In terms of like gameplay, what you can do, what you can't do, I don't enjoy it. Um, I much prefer, I'm not even sure what my favorite uh, season is in this game, but it's definitely anything but winter. If that's a fair criticism to make. I'm just not a fan. This is really not a fan. Alright, let's get some of these eggs going. And then... We did figure out that the new house is going to cost us a million bucks. So, unlike other games where you can quickly stockpile a lot of money that you don't need. You do need it in this game. So, start earning that money, folks. You will spend it. All right, do I have any wool? A little bit, not a lot, that's okay. All right, do I have anything I can put in here? I do, I do. Wow, it's not often we fill those up. Beautiful, all right, let's dump this, this, and this. And yeah, that's about it. All right, next stop, dump some stuff, sell some broccoli, and get into town and get some work done. I don't know why I said that weird. Uh, I get really weird when I record late at night. I probably shouldn't do that. But like I said, I've been so busy kind of trying to get that Pokemon Snap content up that I've kind of neglected filming in advance for Story of Seasons. And it's starting to catch up on me. And I have no new episodes, so I gotta do this. <laughs> I really, really just gotta do this. All right. Can sell some stuff i need some gold and i need some well we got some honey here we can sell and some cheese and some yogurt okay i don't know what lumber i need and that's going to be a problem i do need that and in terms of lumber i just don't know which means i mean i, I grabbed the mirage and i know it's not mirage lumber do need to get some more durable lumber going. Never have too much lumber. I wonder if it sells for a decent amount. Now I'm curious. I feel like it doesn't. Mind you, if you got 20 or what's the maximum? 20. If you got 20 wood maker or lumber makers per day, you could probably make some decent money out of it. That's an interesting thought. All right, let's head into town and see what we can do. We're obviously going to have some cutscenes to deal with, some mysteries to deal with, thanks to the new DLC, and lots more. So let's go check it out. Or not. Maybe if we head up to the... I think because it's gusty, maybe it won't trigger cutscenes, but let's see. So we were bringing stuff to fix this fence, but it's not going to trigger anything. It might be the weather that's stopping us from doing anything. I'm going to go stop in at the animal store just to see if I can see Patricia and see if she can help us out. Because she is the one that wanted the stuff. Hey. But hey. the motorcycle's running well. I want to upgrade my watering can. 20 grand, well spent. Um, upgrade my bag. I can't upgrade that anymore. Next thing I want to do is go to the general store and see how much it costs to buy some of that ore. Oh, I didn't want to come see you. I actually have to sell an ore first. I don't think I've sold one. I'll go check. I don't think I've sold one though. Patricia, cutscene? No. What's she say? Ooh. 
With the town well and truly made over, I have to spruce up animals to match them, implementing, implementing a double brushing protocol immediately. Okay. <laughs> if you see all the cat and dog suits, those are the eligible bachelors and bachelorettes. In case you're wondering why they're dressed ah. up like that. You got costumes in the latest DLC, and that's what comes from it. Alright, I want to buy materials. One log is 16 grand. So I can't imagine that the ore is much cheaper. <laughs> wow. Although, I could trade in a diamond for an ore, technically, right? Alright, let's see if I can trigger any more of the cutscenes for those mysteries. Doesn't look like it. Alright. Doesn't look like that can be done. Um, I'm gonna head up this. Oh, I did before. Nothing happened. Okay. I think it's the weather. No one's outside when the weather's like this, so I think that's probably why nothing's triggering. We did get the better gold watering can, though, so now we can head over to the brand new farm or field that we unlocked, the autumn field. I forget what it's called, but we're gonna head that way. It's called... Bread Maple Gardens is what it's called. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. I love that 9x9 nine nine watering area though. Or 9x9. 3x3. Nine nine. Three three. It's definitely not 9x9. Nine nine. <laughs> oh man. I'm so glad you guys come and stay for the content. I really am. <laughs> if you didn't watch, you would. That's what that that's what I like to think. <laughs> So even with the gold watering can, we still can't water everything in one go because we only get 50 watering slots. That's okay though. All right, I'm gonna take a peek over at the ancient lake just because we can travel to a special location. We just might need to put some more coal in some of these things. Where are we at? Nope, I got coal. All right, let's head back to the farm, please. I think we might spend a little bit, part of the rest of this day, just doing some mining. Ultimately, we're trying to raise that mining level because once we do, we can get access to the quarry and have easier access to that, um, what do I have easier access to? Easier access to that ore that we need. I'm actually gonna go into this mine though because this is where you can find these raw diamonds and they're worth a decent amount of cash. So if I can find some, maybe I'm mistaken, but if I can find some, it's gonna be in here. And we can also find a lot of silver in here, which I think we need some more silver. So it's kind of a win-win. I don't know why I did that though. That was just a waste. All right, let's see if there's anything good. Yeah, some silver, let's take that. And then let's go down. Kind of looking for those raw diamonds and we're looking for silver that's kind of all we really need to get out of this trip into the mines today and we might we're not gonna get diamonds but we'll get some silver right here problem is we'll also get some iron ore oh man jeez we'll get some iron ore that we don't necessarily need oh maybe not coal lump silver and some iron ore okay so that was a waste there's the exit I don't know how many mines are on this one. 20? Or floors, not mines. Alright, we're in trouble. We're gonna get hurt right there. Get out of here. <laughs> Stupid thing. Alright. Let's see. Anything good? Of course not. Let's go down. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 The music is still so good in these games. Like, even, like, it's just, they, they find that right balance. Dang it, I was hoping for a diamond. Uh, they find that right balance between annoying and just, like, soothing and fun. Like, this is very suitable mining music, but it doesn't get on your nerves. At least it doesn't get on my nerves. I guess it might get on your nerves and then... I guess we're having a different conversation, but 
it does not get on my nerves. Alright, that's not diamonds, but we'll take it. Where's this exit? It's gonna be right here. One of these two spots right here. There it is. Down we go! What time is it? It is... Uh, almost 5 p.m. Hmm. Um... We might not stick around too much longer. Just because we still have some work to do at the north end of our farm. Yeah, we're not going to stick around too much longer. One more floor, maybe. Perfect. Good way to end off. Nope. But since I see the ep the exit right there, I mean, I'm obviously going to go down and see what I can find. <laughs> Seems silly not to go down. That's my opinion. Oh, and there's a little pile here. Never know what could be in that pile. Diamond. No, silver art. That's okay, though. Need that silver, I think, for something. Maybe. <laughs> I don't even know. Like, I'm so gung-ho for silver ore, I don't even know if I need it. For anything, like, super important. Alright, nothing here. I'm out of here. Leave, please. this and then head up to this third level and just finish off a couple things before we call the night all right let's see here make me some cheese love cheese in real life i really do love cheese i just realized now i'm two episodes in to recording this evening and I never checked the audio level so I don't know if like the music's drowning me out or I'm just not close enough to the mic I really actually have no idea what's going on I hope it's all right I really hope it's all right oh man I'm such an idiot but thanks for watching <laughs> rebrand idiot Adam maybe that's what I should do I what kind of hits we would get having a channel called idiot Adam Adam the idiot. Who knows? Okay. Back at the main part of the farm. Um. Well, I mean, we can put all this wood back. We don't need to hold on to all that forever. And then in here, we can probably put stuff like this away. Uh, yeah. Oops, and I think we put the glass in here too. There we go. Okay, um, process, and then let's sell this. And then I did say that I'm going to start selling some stuff. I have lots and I know I can get more, so I'm not overly worried about it. I'm also going to buy, because we're never going to get here, so I'm going to sell one of those as well, and let's see what we can get. In terms of money, give me the money. Well, yeah, that's a lot of money right there. <laughs> $157,000. Uh, just because, let's do that. Alright, I think that'll do it for this episode of Story of Seasons, Pioneers of Olive Town. Thank you so much again for tuning in. I greatly appreciate all that you guys do for me. All the fun stuff we've, gone, we've gotten up to together. It's been a fun ride and we're still trucking along. We're still not through year one. I might have the longest running Story of Seasons Let's Play on YouTube. I'm not sure though. Do I have the most episodes of anybody that's done YouTube? Someone let me know. But anyway guys, thank you all so much. Until next time, get some farming done. And we'll talk again real soon.